The next thing to do is press Y on the keyboard to check the audio system options. The driver system needs to be set to ACO. ACO gives you low latency performance with real-time monitoring of VST plugins and virtual instruments. If you are using the built-in sound card of your computer, it's worth experimenting with the Magic's low latency driver, or you may prefer to use ACO for all. Most Firewire, USB or PCI sound card interfaces give excellent results nowadays. From the drop down list, there is a choice between Magix Low Latency or ACO Fireface. In my case, I'm using an RME Fireface 400, so ACO Fireface will be the correct driver to use. The ACO buffer is set to 512 by default, which should be okay for most things, although you can always experiment by setting it lower depending on the performance of your computer. Clicking on the control panel button will open up the control panel for the respective audio device you are using. I think I will set the ACO buffer at 256 samples, which will give a faster response. I prefer to set the device resolution driver communication to 32 bit. Under monitoring setup, leaving the fader to the far right should give you the best results under most circumstances. This will give you a low latency mixer and live inputs. Monitoring behavior is set to tape monitoring and I usually tick mix inputs and playback. So that should do for the audio system settings.